20 episodes already? <laughs> Welcome everybody. This is Romy. Romy Online. Red Dead Redemption 2 100% completion is on its progress. Is in progress. And I know exactly where I want to go, but I don't know if it's going to actually initiate it. My horse is going to get well, me in trouble. I see you didn't get the message last time. Well, I'll be keeping an eye on you, that's for sure. Okay. Bully. That's a bully. Right oh, actually, I think it is initiating right now. I see it blinking. Excuse me, darling. Oh, I thought I saw it. Never mind. I'm going to head over to the fence. And Jesus Christ. It is. I thought it would be appropriate that while I've got my monk haircut to go see a monk. You, kind sir. Hi. Will you help the poor? I show kind. Yes, you are, sir. You have it in you, I can tell. I'm a nasty bit of work, father. You're wrong on two counts, sir. I'm a humble brother, a penitent monk, not a priest, and you're a magnificent bit of work. You may have made some some poor choices, but which of us hasn't? <laughs> you have no idea. But you do. And God does, and that's enough for me and for him. We shall see. That we shall, sir. But why don't you hedge your bets and give two bits to the poor? Okay. There are so many who will go hungry tonight. Of course. Of course. Sure. No hesitation. Bless you, sir. Hey, on, as long anyhow, as it goes to the poor, not your pocket. Somewhat apathetic for cable TV afraid, or something. Yeah. My, um, my mentor says that America is designed to induce apathy in people. It's a wonderful insight. He must be a wise man, your mentor. <laughs> well, sometimes he's a downright fool, but, you know, usually he's the best man I know. That's wonderful. Aww. The, the thing is, About I'm... Dutch. Well, poverty will always be with us. But slavery, I, I thought we had banished that. Like Sandini is acting as a staging post for shipping slaves out to some of the islands. I don't believe you. It's 1899. Maybe you should take a look for yourself. I've heard that the pawnbroker down the block around the corner, the one with the green door, well, they say he sells more than forlorn trinkets. Ah. Oh, Help trinkets! I forgot I need trinkets! Guys, I forgot to buy all the trinkets! Glad to see you again. Completely forgot. Oh, excuse me. I'll just let you bump into me. How about that? So hey, look I don't out. get in trouble for bumping into you. Yeah. Try to squeeze in between these two. Maybe not. Let's go. So many people. Hi there, Mister. Uh, feel free to browse. Shall do. Okay. So I don't need anything else, but you I. You it well. Well, some quality pieces in at the moment. Uh, a bit you're of not a strange the guy. question, but you heard tell of slavers around here, buddy? What? Where are they? Who? People you're hiding. I know they're here. Don't lie to me. Please, they made me do it. I was always good to them, but they they, they forced me to do it, sir. I swear. Where are they? Uh, the, there's a door behind the bookcase there. Just put the big red book called The Scourge of Crossbreeding by Harold McDougall. Oh, hello? Shh, cállate, cállate. Wow. Hello? Por favor, this is also a reminder that help, many people believe because they they don't know that slaves were not just now African Americans. There were lots side. of Hispanics, <laughs> lots of Asians, mm. especially Japanese in particular. Priam, don't put your weapon. Por favor. Please, I'm on your side. It's gonna be okay. What are you doing, man? Well, let's see. Come on. Follow me. 
Gracias, señor. Muchas gracias. Come with me. Don't worry. You're going to be all right now. I promise. That's it. Come on. You'll be safe soon. Steal the register and give it to them. This way. Not much farther. Poor bastards. They will run, so we're good. Welcome back. Why is it? It's pushing me this way. Brother. Brother Dorkin's friend. Arthur. Arthur Morgan. Come on. You were right. I found these two imprisoned in that shop. Oh, my. That's... Well, they are blessed to have met you, Arthur. Trust me in that. They're very unusual. I don't think they <laughs> speak much English. My brothers, come. Let's go get something to eat. Comida. Manger. Comida, please. Hey, he forgot Manger. this. Oh. Yes. Manger is Italian. You, I, Did it say uh, French? Here. Manger Pain. is also Italian. For your services. No, give it to I them. I could not have freed these men myself. No, give it to them. Give to the poor. Give it to them. Give it to the poor, brother. Thank you. I will. Like I said, magnificent. Come on. Come, come, Aww. come. Come see me again sometime. I okay. often work at the old church on Gasper Street in St. Francis. No problem. Okay. I did want to do that mission. And may I make another introduction to something? Uh, while you guys were out, I went ahead and finished that Domino three games in a row. Because I already put like an hour of time of it. You, you guys got the, the gist of it. Of what I had to get done so I went ahead and got it done so now my next gambler mission is I gotta win three poker games in a row no uh, I should be able to record that just one second I didn't want to burp in your faces guys <laughs> okay so I also found that Appaloosa horse I'm not sure if I shared that with you guys last time so now I just need a Mustang and an American paint and of course the hat shot comes later and the herbs come later so those are the only two tasks on this end and over here we got a gazillion exotics to do i did not make any progress without you guys on that and complete 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 why is it going that's it there's 12 here where are the other 12. oh why are you doing this to me thank you we gotta do some more bounty hunting. That's for sure. We need to go to Rhodes and get that done. We have those dream catchers we need to get done too. These are both part of the 100%, so we gotta do that. I just wanted to do the monk real quick before my hair grows out. <laughs> but we've been doing a lot of missions recently, so let's get a couple of things accomplished here. Um, another mission that I was thinking about doing because actually it is kind of entertaining. I didn't think it would be, but one of them is completely useless and not that entertaining, which is the um, the, ele the electric chair guy. Um, it's all right. I mean, it's, it's something to do, you know, if you want to pass the time. But other than that, it really wasn't necessary. And look, now Eagle Falls. Uh, Eagle Falls is uh, the name of the, of the son of the Indian chief. And right now, the Indian chief's name is slipping past me. Um, but Eagle Falls wants me to meet him by Valentine. Um, da -da 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 -da, but let's do this bounty first. And look where it is. It's pretty convenient, actually. I need to go here to check on those egrets since it's not raining. The birds might be able to show up. And this is the side mission that I may actually complete after all. It's actually kind of entertaining. So, Howdy, not the first part, because I told you guys about the first part, but I did not tell you guys about the second part. But let's go catch us some stupid freaking exotic birds, some more exotic flowers. You know, something I've been doing since the beginning of this game. Since the dawning of this game, I've been getting flowers and feathers. Useless stuff. Gator? Anyway. Let's go over here. Yeah. And 
check on it in that little area. While I get the comments up over here. So I don't feel like I forgot. Oh, this guy's dying. Turn around. You need medicine, buddy. Please. What happened to you? I need medicine. Sure. I'll give you medicine. Yeah. You're welcome. Don't eat the pink flowers anymore. Okay. Just tried that plan over there. Mm hmm. Where is it? There it is. Like a gunshot. Oh. Yeah, there it is. By the horse over there. Tiny little bastard. Yep. That's holy and the stage. All right. Yep. Here's the railroad. Some things you learn the hard way. I still need to take one of those flowers, you know, see what it's like. <laughs> I should just stay here. Oh, this fog is not gonna help me. Yep. Is it here? Yeah, it's here. Okay, so leave the... Okay, then. Those are ducks, right? Actually, I need the carbine. Velocity. Perfect. But I can shoot multiple. Uh, are these flowers back yet? Because I need all the ladies of the night. The gator, and... You got any friends there? A heron? Yeah, but usually with this one, there's more. Ah, look at all that! Look at all that. Let's go. Alright, the- Jesus Christ, is that- Did I just walk next to a gator? No. They're flying away! They're flying away! Oh, the reddish egg grip fell. Where did he fall? I thought I saw a red egret. That's a heron. What's going on here? I thought a reddish egret fell. You saw it, right guys? Uh, they're all fucking gone now. I should have stayed on the railroad. Uh, they're gone. Well, I hope you enjoyed the show. <sighs> they're all here. Get these first. You know how precious these are. Skin it. And hopefully now that the challenge is actually existing, they'll present these much more often. As you saw, it was like all game long, only twice did they spawn in this area. Wasn't there one to the right? There were two over here. Did 
that's a heron. Um, here, whooping crane, I don't care. And sandhill crane, I don't care about these. Oh, son of a bitch. I could have sworn I shot three of them over here. Wait a minute. Lady of the Night. All the Lady of the Nights are around this area. And I can get a map to get them done. Okay, but hold on. How many Lady of the Nights did I need? Fifteen. <laughs> but hey, I got the reddish aigrettes. Those are one of the hardest ones. And look, I, I still need the snowy one. Of all things. Alright, come here before come on, the boy. sun goes down. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's not gonna... Are we, do we fit? Watch your head. Good thing I got that hair buzzed. I just barely fit. Another one here. That's a vanilla flower. F you. I see that. Hold on one second, okay? Man, I am getting. I feel like wearing a suit in the swamp, huh? Because I saw one there. I heard a bunch of ducks. I hope they're ducks. Um, I need four more of those? Yeah. Okay. I might have to start busting out the map for these things. Busting out the map. Exotic locations. Scroll on down to this one right here. Lady of the Night. Let's see where else they are. Alright. I am <coughs> I'm dying. There's one right here. Let's go. Uh, I guess I should put it. Let's go. Do my best not to use. Even the gods die in the end. Oh, this is the hoodoo lady. She just creeps you out for a little bit, that's all. With me, shall you? Sure. I may not speak the whole truth, but I speak some of it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you want to hear your fortune, sir? Oh. Uh. There you go. This is now the time of machines, the time of things, the time of man came and went as all things pass, as all things pass, my friend. Okay, thanks. Captain Obvious Travel here. Safe. Anyway, where's the Lady of the Night? Over there. In the middle of that road? Yeah. About here. Is where they put it on the map. So let's have a look around. And I don't see shit. Right here? Yeah, it's here. 
there's one just next to it right here. Here? Here. A little bit off the road, about here. What you want to do is just stand, there's something there. It's gotta be that one. Hey! Maybe it's in it. Um, there's some across the way. Oh, it's a um, Kalaka Hall. Can you come here, sweetie? There's like several over here. And I only need two more. I think I got the. I don't know if I got this. Okay, instead of go to Kalaka Hall, let's go to this one here. By the bayou. By the by, but that's by the by. I think my horse is having trouble with all the gators. Oh my god, I already saw you, lady. Here? A little bit more inland. Right about here. It's probably in this tree. There's one here. Lady of the night. Alright, we just need one more. And there is one right down the road. We'll call it a day. Why is my map on? What is this? Is that the gator? Anyway, I need to go under the Hagen word. Way off of the road. About here. Let's go there. Yeah. Stay on the road for a little bit. That's 15. So, here's what we're gonna do. Park it. Sleep on it. And in the morning, there will hopefully be some stuff again because it'll reset the room, right? I always say reset the room, even though obviously we're outdoors. It's just very... I don't know. Resident Evil 2 talk. And Legend of Zelda talk. Well, it looks like we only need one um, snow egret. And then it's over. We can proceed to stage 2. Ah, oh, it's raining! It's raining! We're not gonna see shit now. Fucking shithole. Yeah. This is the. Uh, yeah, we're not gonna see them at all. It sticks out like a sore thumb, since it is a snowy red that we need. That's gonna hurt. I'll be right back. For anything really sharp white. Can't miss it. Nope. Lovely, huh? Yeah. I might break my neck here. As if I would ever, ever jump off of a railroad. 
head first. This is another lady of the night. I don't need it. We're getting the hell out of here. Alright, let's go get that bounty. As you were. And we have to bring him alive, right? Oops. Jump button was pushed. No jump. I'm throwing you in the fucking river. You ain't going till you get this right. I can't, Eddie. Oh, it's this guy. Oh my god, this one's easy. He, he just here for he your turns himself in. Come to mama, boy. Hit him. Don't shoot. Wanted to say goodbye, boy. You're the man now. You can't be soft no more. You're coming with me. You down. Quit that talk. Just be strong, boy. <coughs> Sorry, bro. There were no jump buttons pushed. Let's see about this. I was trying to go around. You'll go. I already know what he's going to do. That son of a bitch. Come back. Oh, no, you don't. Damn you. Got you now. Come on. No, stupid. I'm trying to hog tie him. Still alive. Shoo. I was pressing the right buttons. Now what was the point in all that? Could have got your neck broke. Prematurely. No more games. <laughs> right? Prematurely. Captured man, they beg or they cry or they rail against fate. I've got nothing to say to you. Okay. Hold on. Won't be long to wearing roads. This is Rhodes. You're almost shot of me. I'm ready. I hope they make it quick. Mark Johnson. You can only run so long, son. There's your cell. You're lucky it's not a great. I was out to buy you. Wasn't hurting no one. Your past catches up with you. That's the price for Johnson. I didn't take it, someone else would have. Tell yourself that, bounty hunter. You ain't whiter than white. I hope your past catches up with you. I swear I'm a good man now, Sheriff. I got a son. I'm not listening. I'm 
getting a white dot behind me. Why? Oh, this crap? No, I hate that crap. That one's just flat out stupid. Um. What are we doing? What are we doing, guys? I'm looking for my friend. Oh, you know. Gavin. Oh, you're looking for your friend. Gavin. Well, there's two horse spots that I guess I should look at, but yeah. I'm not ready to look at it yet. Um, but since Eagle Flies is over there, maybe I should go ahead and do so. Um, let's just stay here for a second. <sighs> let's go ahead and do so. Fast travel to the Cornwall kerosene and tar. Press the jump button. Because we had to actually jump something. So Eagle Flies is on that rock over there. But I need to check here for some horses. And then I'll go say hi to him. I'm just purposely looking this way to now turn this way and hopefully see some spawned horses. Eagles. That's some guy on a horse. Uh, I don't see any spawned horses. Where is it? This way? Ain't no Mustang here. Do you have friends? I already have the Appaloosa. I actually went way the hell somewhere else to get him. Oh, 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 I think I see another booty. No, that's a rock. And that may actually belong to the guy that is camping there. That's the problem. Okay, so he's not even a wild horse. But why doesn't he have a saddle, though? Why doesn't your horse have a saddle, sir? Cool. 
I'm just looking for a Mustang. Oh. I was like, look, there's a horse with a saddle. Hermia, are you alone? She's grazing. Let her graze a little bit. Where the fucking horses around here? Okay, fella. Yeah. So instead of spawning the horses, they spawn the guy with the camp. Stop, 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 stop. Damn it! Somebody with a... It's just reading. That's cute. Alright, let's go see eagle flies, because this is a giant waste of our time. Hello. Look out. Let's make it sure. There he is, just looking at Kerosene and Tar, right? So let me explain all of these missions about the Indian chief and his son because it, there's nothing funny about it. There's nothing entertaining about it. This is obviously a part of history where there is a lot of blackness, is what I call it, in um, in the history of the United States of America. Obviously, we completely were wrongful of removing the territory of these Native Americans. Obviously, they're called Native Americans because they were here first, ladies and gentlemen. They had a place in the United States, mostly to the north, but they were actually all over the United States of America. But the ones that suffered the most are obviously the ones that, you know, um, were large enough to be spotted. And that was mostly, my God, it was the the whole Uruguay, the you know, it was the Sioux, um, the Navajos, um, the Seminoles, the Cherokee. I mean, there's, there's so many of them that were all over the United States. And basically, in long story short, we as a government, mind you, I should say, these are actual feds. Our military actually killed them, a lot of them for their land. What we try to do is tell them, look, can you please just pick up your stuff and just, you know, you can all stay, but you know, we need you all to be in like Oklahoma. And they're like, Oklahoma, I have an everything that I own and I belong to nature. And mind you, when you're so close with nature, you have a specific tree that you know you can get certain things from. And if you go to Oklahoma, there are no fucking trees. So it's like, what do you mean Oklahoma? <laughs> so it's super hot in freaking Oklahoma and Montana and Wyoming, uh, South Dakota, North Dakota, all of these areas where they love to hang out. That's, um, you know, it was territory that they're used to, that they knew really well. They knew the streams. They know which direction they were going, how to get water, how to get food, how to stay healthy. And it, it was taken away from them, basically. But what happens in this game is that the chief, I forgot his name now, chief, whatever, is trying to work with the government to work out a settlement because he's trying to do the right thing. And the right thing is, hey, the government is now saying this is my land and they're going to kill you if you disagree. So in order for nobody to die, the chief wants to make all of these agreements with the government. Well, 
the son thinks that, well, no, this, this war is winnable, and therefore I'm going to try my best, and I'd rather die for my cause of defending my land than to be told what to do by a government who, mind you, will say to you, to your face, we're here to help. Look, we're not trying to kill you. We'll provide you with medicine and food. We'll provide the trip down there. We got rail, you know, uh, trains that we can help you uh, transport down there. You know what they made them do? They made them walk. Okay. They made them walk from like freaking South Dakota to Oklahoma and made only reservations for Indians in Oklahoma. And everybody, that's why they call it the Trail of Tears. That walkway that they made from all over the United States to Oklahoma was called the Trail of Tears. So what you're witnessing in this game is the son wants to say, you know what, F you government, I'm going to try to, you know, st stick with my land by myself. And the chief is trying to comply, but even he is like, they're being assholes. They're not providing medicine. They're actually taking away our food. They're taking away our medicine. They want us to die slowly, but they don't want to put a bullet in our in our head, you know, to basically say that we flat out killed you. Oh, we didn't kill them. They died of starvation, you know. And I guess they're, they're not as good as they say they are with nature and all that. You know, they'll say whatever they have to. So Arthur is here to help the cause, to help the chief help and comply with the federal government and all this and to just assist in that matter but the son has other plans this is his son eagle of flies you came. Said I would. there's a foreman his name is danbury is the files in the office above the refinery room so that in this particular mission my job is to get some documents quick, that specifically state the that, that they're gonna to just the rob them blind and we're not going to do anything to help them or anything like that. Somebody actually put that down in paper. So my job is to get those papers so we can have proof to show another general that we confide in that they're just full of shit. But it's a very sad tale, and I don't know how many times, like, I, I've i always thought of my, of making my own story once, and it was a travel machine, that I was going to obviously make a time machine that I can go back in time, and actually, how, how funny is it that I was going to name the entire thing Timeline, because things happen in a certain order, and one depends on the other most of the time, so you have to have a timeline that alters on a regular basis, right? But then I thought about this whole situation that I think is, again, that one of the out? biggest mistakes that the United States has ever made in their hey, history. Don't. They they yep. flat out just don't care about the freaking enemies and stuff. So okay. Better get a move on it's then. harsh how we treated them. It's harsh that we didn't even help them that much. We just basically told them, get out of the way. And we killed so many of them. So many of them. And in my storyline, I thought to myself, if they asked for help, would I have myself and my team, right. team help them? Up. And then think about it. How would you be able to help them? It's the government. They'll constantly be at your neck to get this land. If they, if that's what they want, they're going to take it. There's nobody you can talk to. There's, there's no. Um, what, what are we doing over there? There's nobody that I can speak to. It's not like, oh, let me tell this govern, this general that I do trust, that you know I'm being, you know, treated poorly or all this and all that. There's nothing that anybody can do. It was the government's orders. Kill all the Indians if you have to, but we're taking that land. We want it. We're going to take it. And we get it. You were here first. We don't want to kill you all and have a really bad history of stuff.
It's just rotten. I mean, there, there's really nothing you can do. And if you really want uh, more details about that whole part in history, watch the movie Dances with Wolves. Ah. You must be Danbury. Who? <clears throat> what? Quieten yourself, friend. This won't take long. Nothing important. A I fire. said go right, and from Arthur went office. left. That was interesting. You're not from head office? More? Is that scene important, important right now? No. I need a file by the Leland Oil Development Company. The one about the oil near Wapiti. I... I... <coughs> More? Oh. Danbury. Think, man. A mind is a terrible thing to lose. Especially over <laughs> such a nice I... floor as this. Oh, let me see your floors. Ooh, the tile work is interesting in here. It's here. It's here. I know it's here. Get it. I'll be checking your ship. Even though I checked it earlier. First time I You're doing come good, in here. Danbury. Real good. They'll give you a promotion for this. No, nope. Danbury. Danbury? Danbury, you okay? Tell the guard you're fine. Yes, it's just. I'm working. All's fine. Now stay quiet. Or head office will send me back to get you. Packet, Arthur. Hey, 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 hold it right there. Weapons on the ground and hands in the air. Easy now, fellas. Now, we won't tell you again. Um. This thing? I can do the hat challenge. Can I see if I can knock out your hat? Nope. That's a headshot. Just in time. I was happy to watch some of that oil burn. <laughs> so you met Mr. Danbury? Yes, don't worry. He was very obliging. I thought you wasn't getting involved. Thought you were going to enter and leave silently. <laughs> Thank you. You saved my life. Thank you. I hope. Well, I don't know what I hope. But who knows? Maybe these will be of some use. Here's your money. 
Oh, it's messed up. Thank you. They've got a really shitty situation, man. Where they can't win. Their only choice was to just comply with the government. It's a military. I mean, what are you going to do? It's the military. Not comply? You know what option B is. This is real shitty. I'm going to sleep right here as long as there's no activity nearby. I'll do it. And I'm just going to sleep till morning. I think I have a bounty. Thanks to what we just did. Let's have a look. <laughs> nah, it's raining! I don't think I'm gonna smile when I rain. It's always fucking raining. It's fucking game. It's fucking game. Stormy! Is it because I have you? Your name is Stormy and it's always storming. Yeah. I blame you for this rain. Bianca's rolling her eyes right about now. That was not necessary. But I need to get up there, I think. Yes, I do. How do we get up there, Stormy? Gotta be alive. Did we come through here first? I'll check this, but I'm pretty certain. I didn't say that. I. What are you doing? Yeah. Yeah. No monkey. Oh Jesus! Before we die, let's just check to see if there are any horses. No. 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 No horses, I'm shocked. I saw that. No, you had the sun a minute ago. A second ago. I saw that. And it caught me looking. It's like, look busy. I know, so Alright, who's next? Who's next? Charles! Oh, what's this? Oh, Strauss wants me to get some money. Ooh. I think I have to do that. Oh, that's um. Uh... Shit, 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 shit. Oh, boy. Okay. Jimboy Calloway is back. But that's a stupid story. I'm. I don't. I'm not gonna. Ooh. I think I have to finish it. I think I have to finish it. Shit. Don't want to. I'll skip as much as I can, guys. Um, it's raining, so that probably that guy's not there. Let's go see Charles if it is raining inside Sandani. Sandani. Uh, let's just keep the story going. Right, fast travel, Sandani. Now all these missions, the Charles mission, the Brother Dorkins um, mission, these are not required for the 100% completion, but the reason why I'm doing them is because they're either entertaining or extremely uh, important for you to understand their role or what's going on, uh, get some history. It's a little bit of everything about what is so great about this game. It's not completely a 100% walkthrough, so if you want to skip all of this, feel free to do so. All of these white missions, you can pretty much skip them, almost all of them. It's just, uh, you need to complete, like, a few of them in order to progress to 
but I've already done what is required. I've done a lot of side pressure. But it's pretty entertaining in my opinion to help Charles. I love Charles. What, what's going on here? That's an interesting dismount. Upstairs? Yeah. To the gallery. Enjoy the show, if that's possible. It's a free show, so don't come asking for a refund. It's an exhibition. Uh, you should know the artworks are not endorsed by the gallery The world-renowned artist, Charles Chatelet. Sooner you go in there, sooner Never you can come out. Seen. I know I'm reading. I just don't like how much time you're spending with the man is all. Just wait until you see his work. It's very progressive. Well, I'm not so very sure how I feel about progression. Paintings or otherwise. Come on. You won't have seen the like of it before. I promise. Oh, Maybe that that makes me want guy. some freaking cheesecake. Oh, hold on. Let I should probably myself. stop looking at it. Anybody want cigarettes? I think that it's Greek. Now the sun's or out. Could be Roman. Here's Charles' paintings. The man simply can't paint. Yes, he can. He does well. The problem is he only paints nudes. <laughs> That's a lot of bootay. Yes. Far too modern for my tastes. Mr. Chardonnay, he's just a terror. It's making me blush. The vagina. I find the brushwork baffling. What's he trying to represent aside oh. from a filthy mess? Stop. You know. Look at these idiots. Excuse me, Mr. Chatonet. Couldn't you have painted some drawers on her? Madame, I paint her in her natural state, as she was and will be in paradise. There's nothing natural about that. Clothes are civilization, repression, death. To be naked is to be free, innocent, alive. Like Buddha said, you know, we are all just here to fuck. <gasps> Well, that explains the decadence I don't know if he said that. Tots. Hey, you got a picture of my wife here. In her delicate. <gasps> Henry, oh. is that your behind? Oh, why would you be showing it to that man? That's my mama. <gasps> as nude as the day she was born. Oh. Stop <laughs> looking at my husband's buttocks. <laughs> Stop looking at my mama. Well, maybe <laughs> she shouldn't expose herself like that. This is disgusting. The nerve on you. That's it. <laughs> oh, come on, Mildred. This is no place for us. Come here, son of a bitch. Oh, you Arthur's loving it. Oh. <laughs> oh. Come on, horse. We'll leave hey, it. I'm coming after you, Frenchie. Hey. All right. Hold on, hold on. I need to get out of this. All right, thank you. Have a nice day. Wait. Um, okay, I'm ready now. Where's Charles? Waste of my time. Hey, where you gone off to, Frenchman? There's a purse in midair. There's a purse midair. Charles, what are you doing? your feet. This show is well and truly over. Let's get out of here. Okay. Come on. I know a place where I can disappear for a few days. This way, this way. Come on. I think we are okay. Huh? The exhibition, what can you say? It was not boring. Huh? Okay. That it was not. 
Archduke test people pushed him. I thought I was a fraud, a no talent brush washer. Now I'm not sure. We provoke emotions, no? You keep provoking emotions like that, and all your canvases left punch holes through. I told you I was a whole ass. <laughs> you did, and you are. Now maybe go be an asshole somewhere else for a while. <laughs> Here we are. I know a lady over here. She may let me stay for a while. Good luck. That picture I gave you, it will be worth something someday. I can feel it. Perhaps. <laughs> right now, it seems like the only thing it'll get me is kicking the balls. Oh, you are funny, you know. I hope to see you again sometime. My angel, my little bird, it's me. <laughs> <laughs> Morning, sir. <clears throat> how, do you, how do you expect me? Anyway, that was pretty quick. Good morning. Da, 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 da. What's not so quick is the next brother Dorkin's uh, thing. But it's kind of interesting. But we need to take advantage that the sun is out. Let's go check for the snowy river. So we're gonna do a mission, attempt the challenge, a mission, attempt the challenge. Let's see how that goes for a bit. That's a lot of traveling. Maybe two missions. One challenge. I don't, know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm doing what I can, eh? I could just do missions. Apparently, it clears the freaking skies up. No, I'm on a challenge looking for birds. None of the sorts. white over there. Is that a bird? Or a horse? I think that was a horse. Right, so we wait for me here so you don't spark anything. And we do this again. Snowy egret. Surrounded by two alligators. Complete the challenge. Por favor. You have found everything. Yay. Yay. All right, come here. Um. Why 
watch the gators. Come on, pal. All right. Yep. Simple enough. Now we're going back into town, and we'll do two missions. Um, let's go to Algerian Wasp and tell him that we found all his feathers and flowers. So we can start stage two of what will be five stages with that guy. Jesus. And um, we'll also visit Brother Dorkins. Get that done. I'm going south when I go north. So let's go back to how we came over here. Probably faster anyway, because it's a dirt road. Now. Cobblestone for old time's sake, but that sucks. To be driving in it with a bike or a car. It's hiding me up. I'm not. I literally do share every single thought I have with you guys, by the way, if you haven't picked up on them. <laughs> Mr. Algerian Wasp. Good day, sir. Oh, Mr. Kilgore. How are you? Well, I trust. I got you the plumes and the orchids that you asked for. You did? Oh, the Duchess of Sorrento will be most happy with you. She's an old friend, the Duchess. Right. Gone to see Let's the proceed. He's just going to chit chat. So, let's look at our next log of crap. Crap, do you need now? Hey, there's the 10 moccasin flowers and the 20 harem plumes. We need seven lady slipper orchids, and that's the one that I got in the bear cave. Um, let's have a look at how many I have. Da, 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 da. Lady something. <coughs> Excuse me. What are the materials? I didn't get any of the trinkets. Lady slipper orchids, right? I've only got four. I need a shit ton more. I need ten? What did I need? Seven. I've got four, it's only three more. That's not too bad, guys. Believe it or not, we, we, we did a lot. <laughs> I mean, think about it. It's almost every single episode of this damn thing. I had to pick up flowers or something. Wish whiskey grew on you. Anything anyone can give me, please help. Come yeah. through. <laughs> Is one guy not outside? No? So I don't interrupt the scene while they're talking and you can hear this. We are now going to meet this nun. This nun, presumably, is in uh, Red Dead Redemption 1, 2. Oh, or I should say also. So she's one of the few characters that you meet in this game that goes into the next game. Like. Uh, oh, sorry, I was trying like to get away. The soon. Sooner. God damn it. 
Not even me. Watch your language, please. <laughs> summer. Summer. I like the summer. Hey, Don't mister. Worry. Sister. My friend. Mr. Morgan. Oh, sir. Brother Dorkings told me about the wonderful thing you did. Oh, he talks a lot of nonsense. <laughs> no offense. None taken. None taken at all. Hey, stop! He's kids that are worse! Don't hurt him, please! Venus I won't hurt him. Freaking kid. You know what I do to kids. <laughs> I blow their heads off. Hey. You all right? Oh, I'll live. Kid did this? Uh, you know him? He robbed me. Which way you go? Uh, that way. Thank you. Get off me! Where's my watch, you little weasel? I don't know nothing about no damn watch. Hey, you! Why don't you leave the boy alone? What's it to do with you? I can hit a lot harder than you. I promise you that. All right, forget it. Little shit ain't even worth my time. Thanks, mister. <clears throat> hey, you want some company, mister? No. You sure? Hey. What? I don't know you. This is Downs? It's Mrs. Downs. Not you. Get away. How? Now. I mean, uh, hey, Help. Uh, Help! Hold on! This man is bothering me! Now. Someone help me! Officer, help! She went into prostitution because we took all their fucking money. Oh, goodness! So now this is a lot of fun. Hold on. I have to return this cross back to the sister without being caught by the cops. This is why it takes long. She's at that church that the little kid introduced me to. It's right here. But to look, even though they're looking for me here, trust me, this is going to move over in a second because even though she's right here, I can't just walk right there. You'll see a bunch more cops show up. So I need to take a long way. Sweet Christ! Stairs. How are you? There's cops everywhere. This one right here. If I go make a right, catching fire, they're all in short. Make a left. Watch. There's a cop here. Now there's two cops here. All right, let's go across the street. How you going? Sorry. Shit. So. Beg your pardon. This 
is where the ladder is. Okay, however you want to do this. So she's here. No, I don't know what you're doing, bro. This will hurt. Mr. Morgan! Excuse me, Father. Sister, I got your cross. <gasps> you didn't! No, oh, I did. Oh, I hope the boy... He's fine, physically. Mentally, he's a piece of work, but who am I to say? Brother Dorkins was right about you. You are the most wonderful man. Brother Dorkins is... greatly deceived, I'm afraid, but I'm happy to help a little. Thank you. You see, it's a thing, but my mother gave it to me when I was a novice. Shortly before she passed, you are the most wonderful man. Oh, excuse me, Father. Sister, enjoy your day. See, Father? Brother yeah. I'm not being hunted by the cops anymore. Ladies? Do I need that? All right, it's getting late, so we should probably sleep again. What's it called? Lamar Quist Street? Oh, the Marquet Street. Probably for the Market Street. Courtenay Street? Where's my horse? Where are you? Start me. Hey, Let's go. Such a good boy. Good girl, good boy. I'm not sure what to call you anymore. Pronouns don't matter. Hello. Let's uh, get some going. Careful. And get us a room. Hey, what's your place? I always get the room first. I'd like really a room, food. please. Get your food. Okay, room is all straight upstairs. Just hit him. Prime rib. That looks good, man. 
I mean, a little undercooked, but Can you keep it down a bit, Lillian? deliciosa with some vegetables. Oh my god, I, I miss eating out more than anything else. Thanks to COVID. Just going to a restaurant, sitting down, having a nice meal. I haven't done that in like a year. <laughs> it's been a while. It's kind of sad. I really don't remember the last time I sat down in a restaurant and ate and had like somebody wait on me. Hello? There you are. To the morning. Okay, kids, we are cranking things out now, huh? I told you, so this second half of the 50% that we have left, it's going to go by a lot faster because these challenges, trust me, they're, they're very time-consuming. The missions, at least they're not, like, challenging. I mean, in my opinion, I can't even think of even... I can't think of, like, the hardest challenge that I've ever done. Like, they're not that complex. You just, you know, shoot things and... Listen to people talk, and then it's over. Like and hey, on the chin. <laughs> He's strategically placed here. Yeah, we figured it out. All right. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? So we just did Brother Dorikens. There's this guy here. We got a bounty there. We do have one more bounty to complete. Oh, there's another one in Rhodes, though. I like doing bounties that are from older cities than current cities, just to get him out of the way. So let's head over to Rhodes and get it that bounty. Explains high finance in very simple terms and how you can laugh at four And then we'll go say hi to Sadie. I think it's Sadie who wants us. In, uh, in our camp. What's wrong with you? Dale. Dale cuadra. Okay. Stormy, wait for me here, sweetie. Um, let's spoil ourselves. Let's go to the stagecoach. Oh, I have, do have a bounce. What are you doing? Be with you momentarily. Thank you, sir. I like to pay my bounty, sir. Like All five dollars of it. Really? Really? <coughs> Let's go to Rhodes. Have yourself a nice trip. Thank you. So, what else we got here? the wrong thing. Just realized I did the wrong thing. Okay. So, having said that, let's see how do the bounty. This will be number five. Five bucks. Sizing that one up. Camille in the video. It's a decent bounty. For the capture or killing, I can kill him. And bring his dead body. Oh, Catfish Jackson, that's oh, where. No what's his name wanted me to take him? See, that's where the money I need to find for Strauss is. Oh, 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 good job, good job, Stormy. Oh, 
breath weight. Stuff I burnt? I can't even tell anymore. Okay, we gotta be careful here. This is where the panther is, uh, This is where the panther is spawned. Okay. I'm shooting to kill frickin' everything. that's not here yeah so they do all this uh, da, 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 da. they want you to go around here but I know to run because they come back real soon stay here boy Did not initiate. Thought I did enough to initiate it. There they go. Send a clear message. Let's hitch the horses and relax a little. Come on, gather round the fire. I have something to say. That's gonna be him. Say it. Jean, Alvin, you proved yourself our brothers today. They sure did. And make no mistake, these are not heinous acts. A vote is an honor, not a right, and in the hands of the inferior and the illiterate, a very dangerous weapon. Oh my God. How is a man of the field supposed to make a decision on something of which he understands nothing? Know that when we act for the good of us, we also act for the good of him. Who's him? Yeah, we are the true heroes. Trump. <laughs> they seek to divide us, but together we are strong. We are bound by our lineage, regardless of language or nationality. Oh, I fight bullshit. for you, with you, because I am you. That's right. Without hierarchy, there is anarchy. And if it's anarchy they want, we will surely oblige them. While we breathe, we fight. You are all patriots. Now let's take a moment of silence for those who fell. Here. Look out! Bounty hunter! Oh! That's the one I want. Nope. I have taken out the wrong one. Is that Stormy? Me, you're no, not Stormy's over there. Alive. Who are you? He's still alive. I'm gonna grab you, ass! Get me! 
I am. <laughs> Get more money with you alive. Two damn club. Ah, Finny's a coward. They had dynamite here. I could have blown it up. You're Let's blow it up. A big soon. mistake. I'll like. come back for you. I promise. <laughs> that laugh. I promise. <laughs> yeah, let's try jumping in the car. Hey. No crime. I fight for your country. Yeah, whatever. Ooh. Thanks. I'll give it to the camp. What kind of guns you got? Release me right now. Money everywhere. Mm, much more than your bounty. Did I miss anything? Oh, Kentucky purple. All right, let's go. Tell me if this ain't tight enough. This is uh, very kind of you. Get your filthy rope off me, you peasant! Peasant. <laughs> Boy. You seek to deny my freedom when I fight for yours? I seek to get paid, that's all. What are they offering? A hundred dollars? Two hundred? I wish you was worth a hundred. You're a cheap son of a bitch. I almost didn't bother. We gonna save you, Jamila Monk! They ain't taking you to the state house! Yep. Here they are! Here's where we wipe that smile off your face, bounty hunter! <laughs> Really? I'm from the state of Florida. <laughs> God damn it! There's only one of him! There'll be more where they came from, <laughs> believe me! I am no criminal. I fight for you, for all of us, for oh our God. future. Oh you God. don't fight for me. <laughs> and the future? Well, that won't be a concern of yours for much longer. I am a realist. That's all. People need hierarchy. They crave it. Quiet down back there. Here we are. You're making oh, a yeah. big Sorry. mistake. I'm here taking him to the, the train station. Side. No, we ain't. Not at all. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I punched the horse. Dude. Take him off! It's the same button! Stormy, I'm sorry. Jesus Christ, Bianca's gonna eat me alive for that. I got the Millimont! See what I mean by punching your horse? Like. Strike me down. The same Sherry. damn buttons. Put him in the cell then. You are a traitor, Sheriff Damas! Sending this Yankee against your own! Quiet down! Oh That's always been all used problems. Too damn noisy for folks good. That's what we'll pay for. I guess that's what I'll have to accept then. Fifty-five bucks. Loves you, this ain't a crime. Hey now. Stormy, you okay? That's messed up. Yeah, uh, you all right there, boy?
Let's go see Sadie. It's pretty close. I'm not gonna fast travel. Oh my god. This guy. It's me. Easy, easy. You can rest now, boy. Some food. Do I have any things for him? It's a nice place you brought us to, my brother. Uh, hello. Yes. Lovely, isn't it? Ah, uh, makes me miss freezing to death in the mountains. <laughs> <laughs> it's that bad, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, it's not all that. Morning, Mr. Morgan. And it's really because of the view. We had such an amazing view on Horseshoe Outlook. Then we had an amazing water surrounding us. It wasn't actually too bad. It felt more open. This feels more closed up. Friend, We're surrounded by mosquitoes and alligators and heat. It's it's kind of irritating for that time. You know, there's no air conditioning in that house. It's pretty rough. So let me donate. My table awaits your offerings, Mr. Morgan. You can't have that. Yeah, I will. But apparently, I don't need this anymore. So I'm going to give you the wax Come ring here, Arthur. and the blue jay, I think. And I don't think I'd take it with me to Texas. I don't know. I can't tell. Uh, I'll hold on to Good it job, now. Good job, Mr. Morgan. Um, yeah, that wasn't really enough, was it? Uh, hi, Sadie. What's up, girl? Oh. No, I don't want to do a mission with Micah. Fuck you. How you doing? How you doing, Mrs. Adler? What's up? How are you? Been quite a journey since I, well, since I joined you fellas. Yes. And now you and Dutch have joined high society. My lord above. Yeah, it seems so. I think my days in polite society are over. Well, I just saw Bill Williamson at a party at the San Denise's mayor's house. <laughs> If he can do it, anyone can. Did you get any leads? Yeah, I think so. You know so, Arthur Morgan. Come on. We need to talk. Miss Sadler, will you excuse us? When are you going to let me come robbing with you, Dutch? My lord, a few more like her, we could take over the whole world. Yeah. A few more like her, there wouldn't be much of a world left. Yes, <laughs> perhaps. Now, the trolley bus station. She kicks ass. I love Sadie. I went down there. I took a look at it. I think we can hit it. <laughs> I ain't never robbed in a city before. Yeah, well, you leave the planning to me. You'll ride with me. Always. Is it just you and me? No, we'll need one more, I reckon. I say Lenny. Not Micah. Well, that depends if you want a massacre or a payday. No, I wish that there was something I could do to make the two of you get along better. Well, that's easy. Make them change. Very funny. What is that? <laughs> no. What the hell have they done to me? Look, they're in the tree line. Everybody take cover! Oh, Driscoll's! The they got Karen! Kieran, not Karen. Kieran. Oh, thank God I have this gun on. Jack, get in this house! Oh, F this. Women and children, inside! Rescue you! Hold your ground! Look like we caught all of them! Mark, they need help. Get down there! 
No, let's put the right buttons there. Okay, there. Women, Karen, get inside. Molly, inside. Inside. Oh my God, Jack's still out here. Get out. Get in, get in, get in, get in. covered quickly. John, you take the windows over there. Charles, you take the side door there. Arthur, you take the windows in the back. Go! That's Miss Adler. Adler. Get her. Jesus. Over Go me. get her. Hey, we got us a lady over here. Hold on. Lady? Say it. Why didn't you get inside? And miss all this? Come on, Arthur. Now we go back. We need you in the house, Mrs. Adler! Yeah. I don't think she's gonna do that. Oh, no, they don't! These are O'Driscoll, so I want to get to the world. Okay? I think so. Except for Karen here. Uh, Karen. Poor kid. Oh my god. Bro. Mr. Swanson, would you take this boy and bury him someplace near, but not too near? Of course. Charles, help me with the box. We need to get this place cleaned up. Mr. Pearson! Ms. Oh, Grinshaw, Jose, I got the head. Oh. Come on now, work! Oh my god, Driscoll. That man can really hate so can I, Arthur. So can I. We need to get moving. 
I away from here. completely forgot so about... we should start looking for freaking... another camp. You ain't thinking big enough, Arthur. You ain't seeing the vastness of our problems and our opportunities. I'm not, not sure I get you. You will, son. You will. Meet me near the trolley station. We got work. Shall we? Oh. Yep. Clean the bodies up again. And for Jack to see something like that is quite upsetting. And of course, he saved my Mary life. Breath. And I could not save his. She really liked Karen. Mrs. Adler fought braver than any of us. Yeah. She is driven by powerful forces I scarcely understand. That's what love has done to her, I guess. I still think that love is much Morning, more powerful force than, it, than hate. I think we love deeper than we hate. Okay. Easy killer. Okay. That's rich from you. <laughs> She's still full of blood. Oh. <laughs> she gives no fucks. Oh my god. Anyway, I won't disturb you. Okay then. Wow. He's not gonna even wash off. Oh. What happened? What's going on with the horses? Is that Stormy? Stormy. What's going on? Let me check the horses. There it is. Oh, it's my horse. Hey, come here. Come here. You're okay. It's the second horse that I have. Wait, girl. Okay. Yeah, good girl. There's a lot of gunshots and stuff. Hey, you're okay, girl. Let me lead you back. Hi, Stormy. Are you okay? I'll pet you next. <laughs> Let's take care of our buddies. So, Kieran is has passed away. They killed him because he betrayed the, the Driscolls and told them about Six Point Cabin. They know it was him. Somehow they got to him. And freaking killed him. You okay, Stormy? How you doing, boy? You're okay. You're super smooth. Stormy likes treats. Stormy loves treats. Careful. Not to be doing it. Now that Kieran's not here, we have nobody to take care of our horses. <laughs> so I should sell this guy. That's what I should do. Alright, so. One less gang member. Maybe we'll get more gang members. That's messed up. That's a horrible way to die. All the women, all these people saw it. So now we just ask everybody around. So, what, what now? Think. We need to start learning from our mistakes. Three. I know. I agree. Let's see how the women are doing. They like Add care. a seat and a swig, Arthur. You gonna yeah. pass out in your own shit again? Oh, give it a rest, Morgan. You okay? I thought we were safe here. Uh -huh. Never make that mistake. This has all gotten a little crazy. We need to find where those O'Driscolls are at and go hit them back. Yeah. Good morning. To what end? 
Let's see what this day brings. You doing all right, Abigail? I still can't believe that happened to Karen. Yeah, bad business, all right. Now, Susan's packing heat now. You okay, Miss Grimshaw? Oh, oh, Driscoll's, Pinkerton's. Is there anybody who doesn't know where we are at this point? All right. I don't know what to tell you. Hey, I need to get Who's your debt. working with you, Mr. Strauss? Yes, well, I suppose it worked out in the end. Tilly. Oh, Arthur, I can't believe those pigs did that to him. The kid? He was such a gentle soul. Yeah, he saved my life one time. I'll miss him. I know. You make the bastards pay, I don't miss Sean too much. If we get the chance, we Karen surely will. shall. As if he wasn't such a bad guy. Karen? You all right? Yeah. That was quite a mess to clean up. Yeah. In every sense. Hi, Karen. Are you okay? Morning, Arthur. You okay? Mm -hmm. Yes. Just thinking about Karen. Yes. He was always living on borrowed time. That's well said. Maybe. Very well said. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Okay. Where's Charles? He did a great job. There's our dog. Where's Charles? Is that Charles over there? I can't right. stay here. What do you mean? Ha. Hi. Uh, Morning. Room here if you want. So that's everybody's thoughts. Um, let us proceed, shall we? Um, we've done a lot of missions. We're getting a lot of stories and some accomplishments, and we're getting to know people, and unfortunately, we are losing people, too. So let's see what the map holds in store for us. I mean, you see, once you get into the, the thick of the plot of this game, it's it's hard to just say, hey, let's go look for horses now in the middle of nowhere. But that's exactly what I'm going to have to do, sadly. And uh, that requires the fast travel. Hello. <coughs> nice dress. Sadie's still smoking her cigarette. Hey, John, how you doing? I'm getting tired of these old Driscolls now. Me too. This feud has gone on long enough. Oh, my hair has grown out. It's starting to look like Daniel Craig. I got the Daniel Craig haircut. I think. I'm yourself because no one else here will save you. <laughs> From the back, it does look like Daniel Craig, huh? <laughs> we all will betray you, and I will replace you. Green eyes. All right, kitties. Let's have a little change of pace here, a little uplifting moments, and let's go to roads and check out. West Elizabeth to see if we can find the American paint since I've been trying all episodes to look for the Mustang can't find it let's see if we can find the American paint and that's only the two horses we have left and I do need to play some poker and um, I may have to go in a little bit but um, we'll, we'll see how that goes So, we're going to the train station. Uh, drop me off over here? I hate it when it does that. 
I don't know if I'll collect Strauss is dead. I, I don't know if I'll do that mission. It's not, it's not all that. It's just somebody else I need to freaking rob. And it's not part of the storyline, and I don't think it's a requirement, as far as I know. It's kind of like that question mark on my map right now. I don't Hello, have to do Jim. it. And it's just, I don't know. It's another part of the story if you want it. But I think I'm going to skip it. Okay, safe travels. I mean, it's just too long of a game. I mean, it, now you guys can see what I'm talking about. There's just no way that you can just play this game in a matter of days and just feel like you got all of the experience of it. And imagine trying to discover how to do these challenges, what's the best way. That took a long time for me to understand what I need to do, how to do it. I mean, I'm still learning, as you can see. I mean, I haven't played this game in a while. And the first time I'm playing on a PC, so it's like, what are my buttons? What do I need to do exactly? How do I do it? It's It can be, you know, time-consuming. This game will definitely... Look, he's nervous again. Don't be nervous, Stormy. It's going to be okay. She's like, ah, there's a tree coming. So, <laughs> what was I talking about? <laughs> I got distracted with the glitch. Anyway. It's a very in-depth game. I mean, oh no, 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 Starmie, stop! Oh my gosh, she jumped in front of the tree. Stormy, Stormy. Stormy, this way, this way. I'm over here. she actually jump in front of the train? <gasps> she might have actually jumped in front of the train, guys. Wow. You be brave. You're so brave. Yep. Oh, look at me! I hopped, I humped your ass. I literally humped your ass. All right, let's go these away. These away. Oh, look, the horse is doing what I tell it. Love it. Appreciate it. Let's go check to see which horses I can't do. <laughs> Since I already know the damn thing in here. Alright, let's check anyway and look busy. Oh look, only one horse. What do we got today? Let's see. Da 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 da, -da. Horse I don't need, Morgan. And that's all we got. And we hope you enjoyed your trip to West Elizabeth. So, let's go to Valentine. <laughs> this is so stupid. Let's see if they're there now, because sometimes th this reset the room. Is there anybody there now? Yeah, there's more horses there now, see? What? But I don't see any paint. The paint is going to have, literally, it looks like there's paint on the side of it. They're all Morgans and uh, American Standard Bread, whatever it's called. No paint. Kiss my butt. Kiss my butt. And we're resting. And going to the kerosene place. And we all know what's going to happen when I travel to the kerosene place. It's going to start raining. Cue in the rain. Don't pretend you're not. I know what it is. It's false advertisement. Now I get the music. All right. Put that for tomorrow? Okay, good. This is pretty cool here. Alright, head south. We're heading south for the winter. And we jump. Can't believe it's not raining. I guess I do have a stutter, huh? 
I always like stop just to make sure I understand what I'm about to say. Apparently I have a stutter. I also think about three things at the same time. That's what my real problem is. I am such a fast thinker. I think you can see that in the way that I move this guy and move this game that I can... I'm doing a lot of stuff pretty damn quick to get it over with, basically. <laughs> and when I'm doing multiple things, I have this nasty habit where I want to do multiple things well. I don't like half-assing anything. And we got a bunch of nothing. Let's go over here to see more nothing. Look at all the nothing. I'm gonna go to the top of this hill and observe firsthand a bunch of nothing. Oh, sorry. Let me look this way. And maybe head over here a little bit. Keep observing this way. Maybe now when I look over here, some stuff will spawn. Especially like off the ridge, like where that guy was. Yes? No? Maybe? Yeah. Please? Please. I just want the fucking orange. Look at them. I hear them. You hear them? I hear them. There's horses nearby. Where do they run? Here comes the rain. We need to find the horses. I just heard of horses running by. Where are they? I heard them. They heard, I heard multiple horses running. Run, 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 run. I don't know where they are, but we need to find them. They ran away from me. Guys, where are they? I heard them. I freaking heard them. Yeah. What about over there? What's over there? What's over there? Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Before the rain gets too intense. No, negative. Go here. Yeah. Guys, I heard the fucking horses. More than one. Come on! I heard them! Easy. Whoa. I hear them again. Yep. What's going on here? Oh, it's these guys. No, but I heard the horses neighing and then going, and they're all like running in a, a little group. They wouldn't do that if they were with a couple yep. of people. Like that was them just now. But earlier, that was the, the spawn. Yeah. Oh my God, get off the fucking horse. Jesus. I heard them when I was in the corner. But with the rain, they might have... There they are. What do we got? Oh, God damn it. Come on! Let's go see what else is over yep. there. Do you have a fourth? Let's just run with them. Well, they were definitely the ones I heard. Whoa! Took like three seconds to stop. Never mind, bro. 
Yep. I'm out. Uh, so, what other things do we need to get accomplished? So, I think we should take a little break from all these missions that I've been doing. I've been doing majority missions. And uh, maybe we should start doing one of these. The Lady Slipper Orchids. Let me have a look at this real quick and see where they are. Maybe I could have sworn that was in over here. Submission to later slip. Yeah, they're all in West Elizabeth. So I'll tell you what. Let's have us asleep. I don't know. I hear possums like crazy. Sleep till the morning. I'm going to go to the middle of the station. Hey, what a shocker. It's raining. No. Go back down. Rest. How's my core? I have no core. That's fine. Let's uh, fast travel to roads. Jump on a train to Wallace Station. We'll check on that horse and get ourselves some lady slippers. <laughs> that sounds ridiculous. Let's get some lady slippers. Usually you buy that at the general store. I get them in West Elizabeth, in the forests. No, no, no! Th this is private property! What? I'm sorry, passengers aren't allowed here.
Time to go, boy. There we go.
Thank God you came, Tacitus. I was panicking. I cannot believe the pressure this woman puts me under. Which woman? The Baroness, of course. She writes the most dreadful missives from Baden-Baden. Still, now, I will finish her creation. Oh, my lord. And after that, it's never ending. Well, if you keep paying, I can keep looking. I don't like to impose. No, keep paying me, and it's not an imposition. Well... Here's the money for the orchids for that ghastly baroness. And next, I think we'll work on this. It's a uh, displayer cabinet of curios for the Contessa de Bellagio's new palazzo on Lake Garda. <laughs> She's asked me to summer with her there next year, but, well, I find the whole thing a little gaudy. Italy is just so overrun with Americans just now, don't you find? <laughs> 
Yeah, it's a real problem. And it's the worst kind of Americans. Financiers, New Yorkers, oh, they're such vulgarians. And, uh, what do you need? The silly old thing has a penchant for lizards. So, I'm making her a series of centerpieces focused on alligator eggs and orchids. Huh. It's about duality. What to do? My friend. My friend, my friend. It is me, Charles Chatonnet, the yeah. painter. <laughs> okay. What are you dressed up like that for? Oh, I am a wanted man, persecuted for my art. As bad as it is, <laughs> I don't think that the art is the problem. In Paris, they say leave. Go far away. We will never understand you here. I say, I go to Saint Denis. They say that is not far enough. <laughs> it seems to me that they were right. But it doesn't matter. Now, I go to South Pacific. They always tell me the light there is perfect for my work. Well, so long as they weren't telling you that just to get you on the other side of the world. Perhaps. It doesn't matter. Help me get to the next ship. They are watching the port, and I need a chaperone. <sighs> Okay, come on. Oh. I'll tell you what I want, miss. Civilization! So oppressive! So stifling! I can hardly breathe in this city! Yeah, I kinda know what you mean. You Why I thought I would find my way in a country founded by Puritans, I'll never know! I know those men! Quick, behind here! Keep up, keep up! Quick! <laughs> we are away! Come now! Follow me! Oh, fellas. On their bar? But of course, I needed to shift. Hey, come on! My fresh excrement was better than any of the drinks they served in there. Remind me to avoid that place. Back, back. The money lenders. We go another way. We go through here. Oh, it's nothing. Uh, I thought I knew me. him. Please do not do that again. Huh. Now get moving. Come on. Hello, miss. So you getting along? So wait. You ain't sold none of your work. 
There is always a heavy demand for fresh mediocrity, but new kinds of brilliance. Not so much. The new kind? The Pauline affairs. We go through there. Where you going, pretty lady? Anywhere you want, mon ami. Oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> This way, to the end of the docks! I was going to buy the red ones to bring out the colors in your cheeks, but then I thought the... Hush! Hey, I may know these people! But maybe something gayer. A purple, perhaps? We are in Saint-Denis, after all. What are you looking at? Yourself, people. If the purpose of life was to be liked, it would be very boring indeed. I've developed the feeling the purpose ain't to be hated. Hate, love, they are the same. I provoke, I challenge, I amuse, do I not? With my impropriety, a mediocre life is meaningless. A bold life filled with art and truth, dirty truth, that is something that matters. Oh, well, it's good to know you got to fail safe for... Look at you, pretty little thing! I know, boys. Come on. Come on back now, baby! Well, how's it holding? Pay attention. I hope the sailors know who they're bunking with. We have many weeks together. We will get to know each other well. Well, good luck to all of you. Relax. Hey, up here. She is my ship. <gasps> we made it! Let's go. Oh, no, 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 no. I got him. Uh, he's out here. <clears throat> Ship's leaving soon. Ah, oh, merci, merci. All aboard for the South Pacific. Adieu. Merci, mon ami. So long. If they don't like you in the islands, keep on going to the South Pole. Ah, yes. I hear there the light is really fantastic. Ah, au revoir. you 
Okay, fella. Yeah. Someone there? Anything to spare for a blind man? There you go, oh, friend. Oh, bless you, mister. Truly, you're a saint. <laughs> yes, sir. There should be more people in the world like you. God bless. What are you waiting for? Piece of shit. Think I'll let you get away with this? I'm just trying to get by here. Oh, come on. It's just a few coins. Let's not make a big deal out of this. Please. I I'm really a fool. You, you crazy bastard! Make you scared. Give me! Let's go! I got places to be.
stranger. Hello, Algernon. Well then, did you get those eggs? Oh, yes. You're a wonderful fellow, Tacitus. A man of a rare distinction. Let's just say I wish I did. There you are. Come on, keep walking. You're late. A couple of days in this place, you turned into some clock-watching city boy. What's the urgency? We need to leave. Forever. We've been doing well, making money. But for us all to leave together, we need enough for a boat. Now, I found a friendly ship captain. He's willing to take us to Australia or Tahiti. We just need to pay for passage and give him money for land when we get there. No questions asked. We will disappear be reborn. Well, where the hell is Tahiti? South Pacific. An untouched paradise. Who lives there? Tahitians, I guess. We made a bit of money on that riverboat job, but not enough for us to leave and live peacefully. Where's the rest coming from? In there. So we are gonna rob that place. Well, I didn't think we was fixing the plumbing. I don't know if you have noticed, but we are on the clock. I reckon we got a few days before the Pinkerton show, and then well, we're done. Now, we need money. Bronte said this place has got money. Come on. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a robbery. Behave as I tell you, and none of you will die. Annoy me, and you all will. Now, remember, we just want money. Don't okay. make us kill you. Give me everything you got. Mr. M. Quick. Leave this these fine we'll folks of their valuables. Mr. S, check that room back there. I got this one. Dying. That's your choice. Hand over Not all mind. your money now. Kindly Quick. open that gate right. and let this my acquaintance okay? inside. I said open the gate and let my Do you want me to frisk him? Well, you got I'm going to need everything you got. <laughs> There's nothing okay. much here. What? There's nothing really here. You're sure? Yes. Then get out here and get ready for company. All of you. Behave. We don't want to hurt any of you. Mr. M, check the safe. Sure. Open it. I don't think they keep much cash in there. Open it! There's almost nothing here. There should be stacks of cash in there. He told us there was. Look again. There's no stacks. A few dollars in coins. That's it. Damn! We got a problem. There's a ton of cops out there. Come on now! We got you surrounded! That's Sick greasy son of a bitch! He set us up! You think? This seemed like a good time for sarcasm to you, Arthur. What are we gonna do, gentlemen? Something! The trolley. The trolley! Follow me, gentlemen! 
Don't damage that wagon. Keep going, kid. You okay back there? Don't worry about me. Just get us out of here. Whew. I think we're clear. You know what, Dutch? Next time, let's not damn discretion. Seemed like a good lead. I know, but... Well, we made it. <clears throat> thanks to you. Don't mention it. Yeah, you're a good kid. Well, we each got... $15. Oh, <laughs> and a quarter. Don't forget the quarter. Shut up, Arthur. He set us up. <clears throat> Played me like a yokel. Put the law on us? What did we do to him? What did I do to him? I guess he thinks he's the king around here. He don't want the likes of you. So, what are we doing next, Dutch? We just need money. One more decent take and we're gone. The bank is our bet. Hosea agrees. Even after that? Uh, especially after that. Uh, I don't feel so good. Now you just got a bash on the head. Come on. I'm taking you back to camp. Hey, you did real good there, Lenny. Just wish it could have turned out better. Well, can't win them all.
frankly, talking like that in front of lazy is exactly what I'd expect from you. You blackbird, you foundling. My dear, I told you, I told you quite clearly that this man, this creature whom the fates have decided to call my brother, is nothing but a spreader of lies and a From the fiery pits of hell. Hello? Oh, you can tell he's not human because of his beady red eyes. How's it been treating you? People have tried to drown him many times, but of course, he floats. <laughs> the only way to kill him is to stab him in his villain heart. Hello, mister. Howdy. Welcome, welcome. Come on in. Oh, you'll love it. Just right along the corridor. Would you like some extra help there? Sure, why not? Good, now don't you worry about a thing. You'll leave this place feeling brand new, you know. Let me know if you'd like a bit of an extra scrub anywhere. So how's it going? Yes, yeah, not too bad. You might be the friendliest person I've met in this town. That's how it goes around here. Gotta take a break sometime. Life's too short. You're telling me. I can tell you're a good person. Oh, stop it. You're too kind. All right, I think that should do it. It was nice getting to know you. <laughs> I've been in Valentine so long, I just don't see myself anywhere else.
You looking for a haircut? So, what are we doing? Put you out on parade looking like that. Turns out a wild bunch of Ain't that just the way it does? So, yeah. Right then, you are all set. Just get out of my way. Oh my god, I just realized that my mute button has been on this whole time. I'm so sorry, guys. Just one second. Guys, I'm so sorry. I've been muted. I've been muted this whole entire time. Uh, here we go. My God, I I have no idea how long I've been muted for. I hope it wasn't too long. But I have no idea what just happened in the saloon right there. How you? So, let me go upstairs. Hello again. Go to my room. Reset the day, and maybe the saloon will be open in the morning. I don't know if it's gonna allow me to sleep again. I wanna sleep until at least noon. I wonder what the hell happened. And I did hear some commotion. I just have no idea what happened. Man, how long did my mute button... How long was my mute button on? And this is why I wish I had people <laughs> in the chat room. So you guys can help me. Anyway, it's no longer raining, so at least that's good news. It looks like... It, uh, no, the saloon is still closed. The saloon is still closed. What the hell happened in the saloon? My friend, you there? Let me do this thing. Oh, Mister. now it's open. Here, let me get this over yeah, with. What do you want? Do I look like a coward? This is real stupid. I mean, obviously where I do. There's these I look two like brothers that, that are trying there, to impress no the girl, can you help? and they're challenging each other to, you know, hey. Watch this, I can put a bottle on my head and I'll let this guy shoot it. There, I'll just look and get it over with. That was fun. That was fun, yeah. Now it's a smaller bottle. There, that's round two. God, look at this. Shoot away, sir, my bottle and Excellent! Fine. Oh! <laughs> right. Now do one while I hop. Oh god. Anyway, grow up, bro. Okay, we got stuff open here. Yay! Let's head on into the saloon. So I have no idea okay. what you guys missed because I have no idea how long my mute button was on. But um, let's play some poker and then we'll call it an episode. Put your butt down. I need to win three consecutive hands, and it's not that that difficult, but um, because you can obviously get up from the table if you think you're gonna lose, which obviously 
before you fold, step away. <laughs> so, let's do this. Skip. Oh, no, and I can at least skip this stuff, thank God. So, cards. Yeah, I'll call. I'm a call. No bet. Skip. What do I have? A jack eight? Yeah, I need to fold. Chick. Now that right there is about the most beautiful thing these poor eyes have ever seen. Well, thank you, sugar. They'll have nothing. I still have what everybody else has, a pair of tens. No bet. Huh. I got nothing. Do I have a, a flush? No. I got nothing. Jack. <laughs> Come on, do something different. There's more where that came from. I don't know what to tell you. I'm folding. I'll fold. I don't care. Letting this one go. All is good. Ha, yeah. This blah, blah, blah. is fine, real fine. Get your money. Let's go. Uh, this works a lot better with somebody that you're playing just one on one. Also, the less people, the better, obviously, because it increases your odds of winning. So, skip. What do I have? Ten seven, ten nine. Okay. Okay. Uh huh. Check. Just a nibble on them there legs. What the hell? Is, did you hear that? <laughs> Ten nine. I got a pair of nines, but it's all hearts. Let's let's wait for the whole table to say what they want to say. All right. You know what? Let's get them to fold. There we go. You're Too rich for me. Yeah, you see. They're, they have to fold because it's this all ain't hearts. No fun you're play like that. Oh, this guy's daring enough. Shit. Fuck. <laughs> Another heart. <laughs> Not now. Yeah. Uh, I'll check too. Check. Go on, check. No, I'll leave it with the check. Uh, we no. got some money already. Cast enough. your eyes on He me. has the flush. <laughs> I ain't got much. You bitch. Right. <laughs> oh, that's a decent hand. <laughs> well, I ain't gonna complain. <laughs> Okay. I don't think you know what kind of K for. Oh, you're playing weak as a little kitten. Settle down, though. I had K2? K4. Uh, I'll do it. Are any of you awake? It's hard to be four other people. I'm gonna raise you. Really? Why huh. are you still here? Do I have spades? I got four. Yeah, I got a flush. Nah. What do you mean a pair of four? Oh, that's not a spade. I'm sorry. That last one. All right, fine. Call. Check. Would you just? Pair of twos. I won with a pair of fours. <laughs> I won with that trash. I'm sorry. <laughs> Ah, well. All right, yeah. but now I won. So now yeah. things are a little different. I have to walk away if I don't think I'm going to win. You want to win right now? You bet against me. Why are you still here? What do I got? K10? Yeah. All right, call. Good. Letting this one go. He raised. That's I have all? to. Ooh, I have to call. K10? No, of course not. Uh-uh, no. What do I... No, it's not enough. I'll check. I'm gonna bluff. You're a pretty dull player. You can play with this. You're an ass. You got nothing. Just like me. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see right what you then. got, asshole. <laughs> he does no, have a pair of aces. 
Fucking A. Uh, Alright, I gotta start pathetic. all over. I thought Damn. he had nothing. He had everything. Ah. Oh this shit. Then why did you check? Fire. Bluff when he checked. Usually when people check, you know, it's because they're... <sighs> Their hand is shitty. Alright, start all over. 10 3. You are yellow, aren't you? I have the Why least sure. amount of money. Huh. I'm a check. Let's play for real, huh? I'm out. I'll raise ya. Hell. Ah. Hey, hey. I'll I'll take cards. It. We earn this money. Now this right is crap. Nine six. Well, yeah. damn. <laughs> Every penny I've uh, I gotta get out of this chair. I'm not getting shit. The only time I won is when I bluffed. <sighs> damn. Fortune. That's it. Ten two. Too rich for me. You really it's up the stakes. Dumb. Not with ten two. Ah, uh, damn. <laughs> hmm. Ain't gonna turn my nose up at that. Land ahoy! We are. What does that say? Q5. Oh, oh you're sure. Fine. Nope. It's slipping through my fingers. <laughs> I'm gonna raise you. Okay. Oh, you're fun. Q5. Nothing. I'm out. Wait! No! I thought I was checking! Oh, god damn it. Q! I'm not getting anything. That's okay. Check so, I'm gonna check. <laughs> and I need to get out of this chair. I'm never gonna get anything. Ace high. But since he checked. I'm sorry about this, but. Yeah. Well, I have to do it. So, <laughs> let's get up. I'm about done. No. Bye then. Get up. And go what to the, the next chair. Did you break a mirror on your way here? But but now, it's currently in progress, so come back later. Key. Hey, mister. Now I can I think so. Hey, hey there. You want in here? I want to sit in that chair. Thank you. Maybe now my cards will be different. I'm gonna regret this gambling when my next pay don't come. Let's go. K7. Alright. I'll call. <laughs> that it? Come on now. Check. K7. Nothing. Oh. Hope this ain't. Would It'll be more of the same. It? Look, nothing. Oh, damn Why do they have all. a full house? Eight hmm. two. What a fortuitous outcome. All right. Let's see some more of that. Well. How am I supposed to win three here? Ten eight. Okay, Check. this is my last hand. If I don't get anything, it's it's because it's just not gonna happen. There we go. Ain't gonna risk it. That's fine. That's all you got for us. Just this for now. Okay. That's a mildly bet from you. Nah. Give me one second, guys. Get rid of this. Get rid of this. Thank you. All right, what do we got? Oh my Pair of eights. Face, will you? 
Yeah, whatever. It doesn't matter. The point is just Cast to win. Your eyes on this. More aces and shit. I ain't got it. Right, whatever, bro. Yeah, I'm, fine. I'm out. So, now. I hope you enjoyed this episode. We're calling it quits because this is designed to fail. So, just walk away from the table. If you don't get anything at all, it's because it wants you to not get anything at all. That's not going to change for hours. Trust me. I've been a stubborn mother fricker. Come here, Hort, Stormy. Hello, sir. This is a quick little mission. It's not even a mission. It's just, it's a little bit of talking. And then we go from there. Hi. Hey. I'm so I went to those four gunslingers, right? Boy Calloway and for a the writer book? called Levin. Drunk Boar Calloway. This bar's got bullet marks to remember him by. Last I heard, they was in San Denis. Had rooms on a riverboat there. San Denis? On a riverboat? Oh, okay then. Hey, Mr. That's all. Howdy there. Hey, What's that? Stormy, where are you? Well, that concludes today's episode, hey guys. Uh, that's all the ah. time that I have, unfortunately. But, um... You guys take care of yourselves, and I'm going to go ahead and save this. I really appreciate you guys joining and watching. Very much appreciate it. And I apologize again for having my mute button on for God knows how long. I hope it wasn't for like an hour or anything. <laughs> so uh, I'll take a look at the video and see how long I went without audio. But again, I apologize if it's uh, too much. And uh, we'll... Talk to you guys soon. You see, this is the boy Calvi. Maybe you'll remember this. Remember the guy that had his head on the bar and that writer? So I did see all four gunslingers. I do have all four pictures of their dead bodies. So that's just to give it to Mr. Calloway. And I didn't think I was going to finish this, but actually you should. It's, it's helpful for your 100% completion. Uh, it's not required, but it's very helpful, as you will soon see. Right? We'll talk to you guys later, and see you in the next episode. This is Romy signing off. Take care.